going to be investigating a small problem that we're having here with our VBA code. If I go to run this particular code, I'm going to press the F5 key and you can see that I get a runtime error 70, permission denied. If I click on the debug button here, we can see that we have an issue with the line that's got the arrow beside it here with the set regex equals create object vb script and the vb script is giving us the issue so we've run this code many times with great success and obviously something has changed in our system if i reset this and take a look at the tools i do have a tools reference for microsoft vb script regular expressions technically i don't need that and it shouldn't be creating any conflicts with what we're trying to do here so there, there's another issue Issue. What we found out is our malware bytes may be causing problems here. So if I bring my malware bytes application on the screen here in my notification bar I have notices and one of them is exploit blocked exploit attempt detected and blocked it is no longer a threat I can click on this and it will tell me what the problem is report exploit blocked and if I read down here we can see the application is Microsoft Excel application hardening and the technique is what really spells it out for us attempt to execute v B script blocked. If I click on the advanced button here, it gives me a little more information, but really it's telling us the same thing that matters to us. So we'll close this and go over to settings, navigate to the security tab, scroll all the way down to the bottom, and we're going to click on advanced settings here under exploit protection. When we click on that, we can see that we have application hardening is the very first thing that's highlighted here on the tab. And we look down the list here, disable loading of VB script libraries. And we can see under Microsoft Office, that that box is checked, which means that they're being disabled. If I uncheck this box, click apply, and we'll minimize this for now. I'm going to shut down Excel. I can save it. It's not going to take that much more time. And let's reload Excel to bring the file back in. And that should take care of the problem that we were experiencing with our code. So we'll click on the developer tab up here and load up our VBA. Bring up Visual Basic. Now if I press the F5 key, our code runs no problem. And we can see that we have a positive result here. So everything is good. If you have malware bytes and you're having problems running VB script, check your settings and make sure that the box under the Microsoft Office that's checked, make sure it's unchecked. And that will enable your VB scripts to run. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.